schedule for me posting this stuff. I just kind of post it and whatever. Um, sorry, the audio quality is probably really bad because I'm filming on a computer and the audio quality is always worse. So as you've probably read from the title and thumbnail, I'm going to be doing the armor quest. As you can see, I've already done the armor quest, but just for the people that are just starting out and want to see it. So first things first, you're going to want to talk to the non-player character, otherwise known as NPC, Queen Ruby, which is in the Skywing Palace, right behind all this stuff. The first fire that you're going to want to find is very easy, and it's literally right next to the uh, Skywing Palace under the nursery. It's over this bridge thingy. You basically just veer left right out of the palace. It's right under the little balcony thingy. You know, it's right under this. This is the first fire. Again, I do just like breathe on it. Uh, breathe fire. And also you have to do this as a Skywing. Otherwise, Queen Ruby will offer it to you. Second fire is very easy to find. This is kind of in a circle, you know, trail thing. Sorry, it's so laggy. This computer is probably older than me. Actually, that's a lie. If it was older than me, it would take up the entire room. Point is, next fire, flipped. Okay. The next um, armor fire is right near the Dragonettes of Destiny cave. It's this top ledge. Uh, the bottom ledge has a fire, but it's not a guard post. Just breathe fire. And also, I'm not doing a thumbnail. I'm just going to kind of like, you know, just take a screenshot of something and make it the thumbnail. Because <laughs> I'm just posting this. Okay, point is, next, this fire right here. Also, it'll tell you, like, it, there's a, there'll be a thing that'll pop up on the screen that's like, you lit this fire, however many fires you have left remaining. So the next fire is right where you get one of the horn rings, and if you want me to make a separate video on how to get the horn rings, I can. So this one's the easiest because there are guards on this post, and for the other ones, except for the one with copper, there are no guards on the post. So, right next to General Comoran, you just light this fire, and bam. Next, you know, fire that we're going to light is basically straight ahead. If you can see the little yellow, yellowish-orange blob on top of a ledge is the next fire, and that's where copper is. Copper is the dragon you can talk to to get the ruby in Bedman's quest, and which I have completed, and I can also show you how to do that, but there are countless videos on this. So you just go to Copper, and you light the fire. Bye! This next one is the hardest to find, and it actually took me a little... But it's right next to the arena, and it's right there, and I usually miss it, and in the first... Uh, version of this, I actually didn't get to to do this one because I forgot where it was. But it's right here. Um, this is where it is. You light it. Come on, fire. And that should be the entire quest. Now all you need to do is go back to the palace and talk to Queen Ruby to receive your um your uh, armor. So yeah, that's really all you have to do. You literally just have to go back and talk to Queen Ruby about it. And then you're wham bam, yes ma'am, all done with the armor quest. So I hope you found this video helpful if you were struggling on this because I was for a while and then I saw Bellasaurus's video on it, which I will link in the description, which was very helpful. And Sorry that my computer is really laggy. I know it's laggy. It's really annoying, but that's okay. 
and please make sure to like and subscribe for more content because I would appreciate it a lot. So yeah, that's the video. Um, I hope, again, I hope you found this helpful. I hope you use this as a way to find the flyers and get cool armor. And I have the game pass where you can like color the armor. As you can see on Whirlwind, it's black. And so, yeah, uh, thanks for watching, and goodbye. I will see you all on the next video.